What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to EU4 as Virginia. Uh, last episode. Was it last episode? Sorry if you just and un did the zip on my jumper. Don't worry, nothing weird's happening. Um, <laughs> there's Washington, which we took last video. I'm pretty sure some people have recommended uh, last video. No, it must have been two videos ago. I can't remember either. <laughs> either way, um, recently people have recommended I make it the capital. I am tempted. But at the same time, I think we should stick with the authenticity of being Virginia and keeping Richmond down here as the capital. So we're going to do that. And I also just saw for the first time noticed how big South Carolina is now. We'll have to keep an eye out on them. But of course, at the moment, this is what our alliances look like. So we'll be aiming to finish off North Carolina, grab as much as Maryland and Ohio as we can. And then we're probably going to have to, you know, go after one of our allies. But that, that's a way away just yet, I imagine. Uh, when can we go after North Carolina again? 1547. Well, that's not going to happen anytime soon. Maryland is 1535. That is three years time. Ohio, we cannot go after for another yeah for another year either. But are they in a war right now? They are not in a war right now. But they have a lot of strong friends, so we won't be going after them. Most likely, it would be Maryland, who only have a few provinces left. They lack allies. I see Pennsylvania is still at war with New York. I didn't know they were still going at it. But uh, Pennsylvania's now only got 8 war score, and this won't be good for them. I don't see this going too well anymore, although they are still winning, so just. I could do with getting a peace deal soon. North Carolina, yep, you can claim Richmond all you want. I don't think that's going to work for you, buddy. I wonder when Florida's just going to remove Alabama here. They're just sat here with no allies. That's That can't last, <laughs> I'm sure. We do need to rebuild our navy, but... At the same time, I don't really have the ducats to do that. Um, so if I wait a little while, that'll be fine. I mean, how much? 45 just for one ship. And it, Okay, heavy ships are expensive. That's all I know. I don't even know what we'd go for. So I'm going to leave that for a time. For the time being, we it's not like we need them. It's not It's not a urgent thing. We are going to see some Maryland separatists pretty soon. They're at 80% right now. I think we're finishing coring... Of something. Oh no, we have done it. Okay, so it doesn't matter. War exhaustion is a bit high. That might be the problem. So we could probably do that. Reduce it by spending 75. I think we probably don't want to. Oh, we could do it. It doesn't matter, but I just think we should be okay. Lose 10% global trade power or gain one inflation. Let's gain the inflation. And then I can also reduce that by two. I mean, it's not that high. It'll come down. It'll be fine. Clergy gain influence, which is probably important because it was quite low. Well, not important, but it was. It doesn't matter. It was very low, so it's all good. Michigan is having a weird, just <laughs> weirdly being pushed up this way, but they're not going to be around for much longer. Kind of worried about Indiana here. They're starting to take quite a bit of land, looking kind of scary. Luckily, they border New York, which will like you know slow them down at some point. Trade efficiency plus ten percent, excellent. That has got to be probably making us some more money. We're up to six point two seven ducats a month. Obviously, we don't have a navy. To pay for, which is the main, uh, minus 10%, minus 25%. Are you serious? <laughs> it's just my luck, isn't it? Just my luck. What does this do? Gain one stability. Well, there you go. We're up to three stability. I mean, that is a benefit, if anything. Some good news. Right, when can we go off? Okay, so we could declare war on Ohio right now, but that would lead to a war with Wisconsin, Missouri, and Indiana. Florida and Kentucky would join, but I'm going to wait and see if we can go after Maryland, who don't have any allies yet. South Carolina would already join. I think I can do it by myself. I mean, it would be pretty easy. How long have I got to wait? That's the December 1535. And uh, we keep this guy. Yeah, keep him for one more term, probably. He is a 666, so he's doing pretty good for us right now. Uh, come on, Pennsylvania. Okay, Pennsylvania isn't... Yep, and they lost some land. Okay, that's not good for Pennsylvania. I feel like they're probably going to be the ally that we have to backstab at some point start going after them instead because i do not think they are going to be doing that well forever not anymore anyway new york that's kind of worrying because if new york just keep taking stuff from them i'll be next probably because by that time i'll have maryland although that might be enough you know no, who knows taking maryland might be enough i don't know if we can take all of it that will be 74 percent i wonder how much um Aggressive expansion would get for that. I managed quite a lot. It's down to zero with everybody now, so that's good. 
Now to April. Please tell me they don't. <coughs> if they get an ally, I'm going to be really annoyed. <coughs> very, very annoyed if they get an ally. Oh, New York's just not stopped yet. Yeah, New York's mad. They're going off to New Jersey now. It should be pretty easy for them. It's no longer a rival because New York is about to own it, which is kind of scary. Uh, okay, new, too few rivals. Who are my rivals? North Carolina, Maryland. I can't set Ohio. I don't want to set New York. I can set Pennsylvania, but that would really annoy them. Just since I have no navy. It's going to be South Carolina, Quebec, Kentucky. It's got to be New York, hasn't it, in this case, I guess. Boom. Let's do it. I mean, we tried to keep relations fairly good, but we've been at war with them a few times now. It ain't going to stay that way. I probably could have done Pennsylvania, but that would have definitely broke our alliance. And Pennsylvania, to be fair, have a lot of other friends. They just didn't want to join that war. Which is probably smart for the other friends. Okay, I'm going to start building a navy. I don't really know what to go for. I think we'll go for... Uh, I, don't, I don't even know. One, two, three. It, it takes ages to build the boats. One, two, three. One, two, three. Lots of transports. And then we'll get some... Wait, light ships are better in the small seas, aren't they? We probably want just a few heavies. I don't know. One, two. And can I afford one of those as well? And then we'll just keep adding more over time. But that should be fine. That'll be enough. It's going to take ages for them all to be built anyway. So we won't see our money not going up so much for a while. So while we're still making seven ducats a month, that will be helpful. December is coming around very soon. Maryland is still friendless, which is great news. September into October. Okay, it's time. Let's get ready. Let's get ready to go in and um, take them out, basically. Where do they have forts? So fort level three here. Capital fort. It's anywhere else? Nowhere else has a fort. Okay, I'm just going to go straight for the fort. As you'd expect. Do I have a claim? <laughs> that is the next big thing. Uh, I have oh, I have claims on everything. That's good news. I imagine once the um, whatever it, what's it called, the truce runs out, more people would be willing to join. Should I need them to? But, yep, Kentucky would now join. Let's take which province do I want the most? I think M Montgomery is like the most important one we grab. Let's go. There we go. Okay, twenty stack, go straight in there. Try and grab that capital province. Make sure we siege it down nice and quickly. Oh, and we're already in a battle. We should win. Yep, we won. 14 war score. Nice job. Okay, now we just need to wait. Actually, I'm going to do this very quickly. One. This unit. Can you go over there? Good. Okay, I'm going to do this. Just quickly so that we can make sure they don't build any more division. Divisions? Men? Whatever we want to call them. There we go. And that should occupy all this stuff and prevent them from making any reinforcements, basically. That's a good idea. <laughs> Why did you go that way to go there? I have no idea, but is it not enough? I don't think it's enough, which is weird because it's only an occupation, so it should be enough. No, it is enough. I have no idea. It might work. No, it's not doing anything. Okay, well, that... Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> I thought it might work, but I think it's probably too small a stack to do it. Never mind. Just come over here and help out then. Get this job done a little bit quicker. Just stick it on speed 5 while we're sieging them out. No point in waiting. Just see how things go. This is good news. Yes, our ship costs went down, which is a shame because I've already paid maximum military. Oh, okay. Well, the first thing I'm actually going to do is something I know you're all... Angry at me for not doing already. Where is it? Raise war taxes. Where's the button? I can't see it. It must be over here. Yep, raise war taxes. Boom, more money. And how can else can I spend it? I can get another general, I guess. I already need one. Though, that's what I'm thinking. I've got two out of three. I may as well have one. Maybe it'll be a better one. Nope. Okay, not as good as the one I've got. This actually declined again. I assume it's because they have a two stack, which is definitely going to go over there. Oh, no, they just attacked me with a two stack. Smart move. Full of, um, <laughs> brave. Didn't really work out for you, but smart. Oh, okay, there we won. hundred. We have 99% war score. Well, that's crazy. <laughs> Good start. 
Good start. Just just make sure we occupy everything. Pennsylvania declared war on Maryland. Are you serious, Pennsylvania? Are you serious? Okay, well, I'm going to take these three provinces, probably. Depending on the level of aggressive expansion, that's going to give me. And this is probably the end. For Pennsylvania... For Maryland, sorry. Um, okay, I'm going to reject their peace deal. Actually, they're willing to give me three provinces. How much? 23.8 aggressive expansion. Okay, bingo. That that seems fine. That was exactly what I was going to ask for. How bad is thing are things right now? They're bad, but minus 46. Okay, I can't go to war because if New York forms a coalition against me, that's when you know it's bad. That is when you know it's bad. Uh, all right, make core, make core, make core. We've got plenty of stuff laying around. Mer we can't have Maryland as a rival anymore. It's going to have to be Quebec whose navy is 825% stronger than mine. That is not alarming at all. Yeah, it's going to have to be Quebec, because it just can't be Pennsylvania right now. Estates demand control of provinces. Okay, fine. Uh, this one? Have I given you away? No, wait, no estate can be selected. Oh, where's one I can give away? This one. Okay, who do I need to give it to? I didn't even look. Uh, who was I supposed to give it to? How did I forget this? Uh, the burgers. Okay, that that's it. I remember now. There we go. They should be happy now. You have claims on provinces I don't own yet. Cool. I can't do any more warring for a while now, as you can imagine. And Pennsylvania actually called in everybody else by the look of it into their war. Let's have a quick look at who this involves. Uh, oh, I think they just took Maryland, actually. Yeah, they took Baltimore pretty easily. So... That was easy for them. Kentucky wants... Wait, who are you at war with then, Kentucky? No one. Oh, I don't know why they want military access then. I think they're just stuck or something. I don't know. Either way, it doesn't matter. You're not going to fight those rebels? Oh, you're in the wrong province, that's why. Either way. Either way, there we go. Crush those rebels. Nice. Nice. Okay, well, our general just disappeared. Good job I got another one. But I'm tempted to go for one more. Just... Oh, there we go, two star. Excellent. I think we'll probably soon need to just make our army a bit bigger. Our force limit is 32, so we can go a lot bigger than the 20 stack we currently have. It's just whether we can afford that. This is going to start to look messy, so I'm going to make sure my boats go to the same place. We can stack them all up. What's our manpower level now? We're at 30,000, and our max is 31,000, which is good, because it's about the same as our force limit. So, that's all good. Just going to have a look over here in the west. It's all still a bit of a mess, and come back, oh my goodness, what is going on over here? Minnesota, doing something. Um, New York is being invaded by Quebec, that's good, that's good, that hopefully slows them down, we've got to hope New York lose, but don't get crushed, obviously. Military tech, level 12, we're at plus 200, we're 20 years ahead of time right now, which is ridiculous, and I just, I don't have any more rivals. This is kind of crazy, I assume, when can I go after North Carolina again? 10 years, that, that sucks, well... You know, I'd probably need to wait that long for the aggressive expansion to wear off anyway. So we'll spend that time wisely, just getting involved in other people's wars. Making sure everything stays okay. Let me just make sure I've upgraded everything. There we go. Ah, uh, wait, what? I, just, I don't know what just happened. It said something about the cannons, but I don't think it meant to. Either way, our army just got a little bit stronger. And we can get another idea. We may as well just keep going down here. Another merchant. Excellent. Let's keep following. Okay, Kentucky is requesting you come to aid in Kentucky in conquest of Butler against Missouri. Yep. Okay, Kentucky. How's this looking? How is this going for us? Kentucky, Florida, South Carolina, Virginia. Yeah, I think some of these bigger wars are going to start breaking out. This is should be fairly easy for us. Kentucky and Florida can deal with these guys. I'm just going to go go after Ohio because they have a one stack. <laughs> um, I don't want any land, but. You may as well go get involved. This is getting, this is really entertaining. Like this series, I'm not gonna lie, it started off pretty slowly, but right now things are just happening all the time, and it is we're, we're still alive. Like usually when I do like the um, I tried to do like the modern day sort of stuff or the the EU f extended timeline stuff, it usually ends up going badly for me because you know I'm sort of reliant on one chance event that never happens. But here we're doing okay. We've made it off. To a good start, the problem is my group of allies from the East Coast have survived, which means we've now got to start going.
going after each other. But that's going to be it for this episode. As always, if you have enjoyed, be sure to leave a like and a comment down below. Be sure to subscribe if you're new to the channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.